Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Wesley. Welcome back to another food review. Today we're going to be reviewing the signature Zaxby sandwich with spicy Zax sauce. You know, I got the bag right here. Uh, and, uh, you know, this is, uh, I'm bringing this in part due to all of the positive uh, feedback from the last video. And, uh, the phone fucking falls. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> okay, uh, let's put the phone back up and start over. We're gonna start over. Or, we're not actually gonna start over, but, uh, yeah, this is, uh, partially in, you know, in part due to the positive support on the last food review. Uh, and I really appreciate that, guys. I really appreciate all the support on that last part, uh, with the, the, uh, what was that? The grilled, the grilled chicken sandwich, uh, the spicy grilled chicken sandwich from Chick-fil-A. Uh, that thing was awesome. Uh, honestly, I, I enjoyed that more than I've enjoyed a lot of food, you know, as of lately. So, uh, today we've got the signature, as, as I mentioned, the signature Zaxby's chicken sandwich with spicy Zax sauce. We're going to see how this thing is. I've never had it before. Like, I might have had the regular signature um, with the, you know, regular Zax sauce, but I've never had the spicy Zax sauce on it. And that would have been a long time ago. Really, the only thing I, really the only thing I get from Zaxby's are either the... Um, you know, the buffalo, uh, either the buffalo wings or the, with like sweet and sour sauce on them, or I usually get like the grilled chicken sandwich, but I never really get the, you know, the fried chicken sandwiches here. So we're going to see how this competes with the spicy chicken sandwich from Chick-fil-A, uh, see if it's any good. And, uh, ho hopefully it is, hopefully it's pretty good. So, uh, let's go ahead and get, get this bad boy out. You know, we got the, the packaging here, uh, some nice packaging with, uh, you know, just a bunch of logos and, you know, just uh, history behind it. We got the history packaging here, the history channel packaging. So, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and uh, open this bad boy up. And we're going to see what this looks like. And, of course, you know, I can't you can't, you can't go without sweet tea at a place like Zaxby's or Chick-fil-A. So I got the sweet tea. Uh, and, you know, these are like the two top, in my opinion, top quality fast food restaurants. But I'd say that Saxby's is like right behind Chick-fil-A. So not, not exactly on the same level. Okay, here is the sandwich. I'll go ahead and take it out and show you guys. So first thing I'm going to say, it does look kind of like the Popeye's chicken sandwich, but, you know, without the mayonnaise on it. Um, and, you know, we got, okay, we got the pickles. We got the pickles. That's a good sign. So there's the pickles. There is the spicy Zach sauce. And there is the, uh, you know, the chicken there, the nice uh, breaded breast of chicken. <laughs> we got the, the bun. It's actually, um, you know, kind of greasy. I'm not going to lie. This is a very greasy bun. But sometimes that can mean a good thing. Sometimes that can be a good thing. So we're going to go ahead and try a bite of this. It's already got the sauce on there, so we don't have to worry about the sauce. Let's see how this is, guys. Let's see how this competes with the spicy chicken sandwich. And there's already uh, random droplets of food dropping again uh, in the car. <laughs> uh, yeah, the, the, once again, we're doing this at 8.30, the same exact time. I don't, I don't know what it is about 8.30, but the food reviews are just coming at 8.30. So let's go ahead and uh, try this. Um, and it, it's probably because I, I dash, I door dash around this time. So maybe that's maybe that's why it is. I mean, I just get hungry around, the, around this time. So let, let's do this, guys. Let's take our first bite here. Okay. Okay. This this is um this is flavor guys. This is this is next level spice with that salt with that with that spicy Zach sauce. This is like it's kicking it. It's kicking it. It's not it's not really spicy, so I mean are they honestly the advertisement a little misleading. It's not really that spicy, but it's got flavor. I will say the chicken could be a little bit more, you know, a little more, more cooked. Like it's a little like I'll show you guys. It's a, it's a little, like, not raw, but just a, a little undercooked, but it's still really good. Let's try another bite here. It's that second bite. It's that second bite. <laughs> okay, that second bite just, I, I got the pickle in there. And uh, like, like I said, I said in the last video, if you if you don't get the pickle, you are criminal. Like you got you gotta get the damn pickle. The pickle makes the sandwich like two times better. It just like, it instantly makes it better, makes it juicier, more flavor, more more just you know I don't know more sandwichy. Uh, it's 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 kicking it. This thing is great, guys. Um, so far, so far, we're, we're gonna do one more bite here, and then um, I'll get my final verdict on the signature Zaxby sandwich with spicy Zax sauce. So let's let's try one more bite here. Okay, okay, yeah, th this is um, this is some next level stuff. I mean, for Zaxby's, I'd say this is probably one of the better things I've had here. 
Does it win the 1v1 on Rust against Chick-fil-A? I'd probably, uh, I mean, it depends on what, what guns are being used, because, I mean, if it's an intervention versus the Bear 50, Chick-fil-A just stream snipes the, the fuck out of it. No, I'm, I'm messing around. <laughs> Uh, it's, it's good, but I don't think it beats the spicy chicken sandwich from Chick-fil-A with honey roasted barbecue on it. I think with, with, without the sauce, I think this might slightly win without the sauce on the Chick-fil-A, uh, sandwich, but it's like so close. I mean, I think when, when you add the, the honey roasted barbecue on the spicy sandwich, that wins easily at Chick-fil-A. This thing's still good, you know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna give in, uh, you know, a rating on this thing of like a 8.5, but it's not, it's not a 9, it's not a 9, I mean, Honestly, it could have been a little bit fresher. The The chicken uh, is a little undercooked, not severely, but, you know, like I said, I still give this an 8.5. It's still a good sandwich. So, you know, definitely, uh, you might want to, you might want to give this thing a try. You know, um, if you have a Zaxby's near you, this thing, uh, might just be on your, on your next, uh, you know, pickup list. <laughs> we'll, we'll give one more shot there of the sandwich, but it's not bad. You know, it's not bad. I do have some ranch, but I'm probably going to save that for the fries, to be honest. And I don't really need to, need to review the fries, but hope you guys did enjoy another food review. Uh, I appreciate all the support. Uh, I will say it's, it's a little messy. And like I said, it's not the best tasting sandwich I've had, but it's definitely not bad. And, um, you know, if you're, if you're just stopping by for a chicken sandwich, this thing is worth getting still. I think it's, uh, really good. So thanks for watching another food review, guys. I will catch you all later. See ya. See ya.